issue in Albany, the law giving Mayor Bill de Blasio control over the city's public schools will expire at the end of the month unless lawmakers vote to renew it. The mayor and other Democrats favor a multi-year extension, but Republicans in the state Senate say any extension should be accompanied by changes aimed at helping charter schools in the city, an idea that faces opposition. <laughs> Our series MTA Out of Order continues tonight with the blame game continuing between Governor Cuomo and Mayor de Blasio over the broken subway system. Stacey Delicat has the latest back and forth. If there's one thing New Yorkers seem to agree on right now, it's that the subway system needs help. And it's gotten considerably worse. So this is ridiculous that we have to wait so long. We got places to go. We gotta get to work on time. But who should fix it is at the center of a political debate. The MTA is overseen by the governor, but calls have intensified for the mayor to step up and pony up, with the MTA accusing the city of shortchanging mass transit. We have the plans, but we need the money and we need the city to pay their fair share. MTA spokesperson said. De Blasio, who was snapped by a Times reporter taking a rare ride on the C train yesterday, says the city is already paying plenty. The um, reality is the MTA has a very substantial budget, including the $2.5 billion we gave them. And the money is not being directed at our subways sufficiently. Governor Cuomo, appearing today on New York One, pointed to the so-called genius convention he's holding later this month to tackle how to modernize the subways. The state stepped up big time last year. We have a $32 billion capital plan, the largest in history. Uh, the problem now is how fast can you do the work? Mayor de Blasio says he plans to shift more of his focus to the subway as service deteriorates. I'd say if the MTA can fix the problem, that is the optimal solution. If the MTA will not fix the problem, I'd rather have the city of New York run it. Riders fed up with mounting delays and overcrowded trains say they don't care who takes charge, they just want something done. They both should do more. I think they need to decide who is going to pay for it and just make sure it works. Mayor de Blasio said New Yorkers can expect to see him taking the subway more in the coming days and weeks as part of making a point that the system needs to be fixed. But he had no answer when he was asked whether he thinks that Governor Cuomo should do the same. In Times Square, I'm Stacey Delacat, Fox 5 News. On-time performance, Penn State.